Okay, we are going to try another boot up. I went ahead and unplugged it in the back of the computer. I mean, I just had to move my stuff out of the way to get around there. And uh, it wasn't as hard as I thought, but to get to it, I could reach it fairly well. Let's see what happens here. If it recognizes this, nope made no difference whatsoever so what in the world is causing this thing to stop recognizing that SD card uh, and adapter I started up without anything sometimes that actually helps I think I've already done that several times <coughs> I'm going to hit F F11, get into the boot screen, let's try this, something I haven't tried, <coughs> I'm going to plug it in with it sitting there, <coughs> plug it into a different slot than the one it's in, and instead of hard shutting it down, I'm going to hit Control alt delete I mean, whenever you haven't been messing, haven't had to hard shut it down, it recognizes my that thing over time when you have <coughs> then it gets on I'm not seeing it finally okay write this on your back of your hand Don um, how did I do that okay I hit half 11 <coughs> <coughs> went into the <coughs> I actually did that without anything in there. <coughs> Sorry, <coughs> I had a drink. So I hit F11 during the boot with nothing in there. No USB stick, no SD card. Got it up to the uh, boot menu. Put that thing in there and then hit Control Alt Delete to reboot and it saw it. No, why did that make it work? Why did that trick it or whatever? I always want to say trick it, of course. It but uh, there we go. <coughs> and if I could just remember that. What? Why did it do that? Control Alt Delete. I did hit the, yeah, I hit the my storage device. I'm just going to wait this time and see if it boots to it. Done. I'll hit the F11. Then something different. That actually is uh, usually means there's a boot error. Maybe the boot part of this uh, SD card has gotten broke. Maybe there is a problem with it. I may have broke it fixing it a while ago, like I was saying. Uh, what uh, G Party may have fixed, you know what? That's what I did. I shouldn't have done that. G Party fixed it back to just a normal SD card without any boot. Uh, it took away the boot. It took away my boot menu and all that stuff. And what it needs to boot. I don't remember if it uses Grub or uh, ISO Linux, but whatever Sardu put on there, probably ISO Linux. Whatever Sardu put on there, it took it out. It broke it. So uh, it's it'll just sit there like that blinking, barely. Only in the, in the video you can barely see that little blinking on the left side. I'm gonna reboot it again. See, it's not not trying to go into Windows, so I know I didn't try in Windows. I may be hung up. Yeah, it usually hangs up when that happens. So I kept fixing it till I broke it. I kind of feel I shouldn't do that. Shouldn't have done it. Now that means actually means more problems than ever because uh, Sword's using this. VBA Rescue is not the most important thing anyway. It's not my absolute favorite virus scanner. I actually was thinking in uh, another thing that I might do. 
trying to hit. I'm hitting F11. I'm trying to get it into the boot menu again. I think it's hung up. <coughs> That's why when I hit that thing, it, it went on by the windows. So if I wouldn't have been fixing that SD card, you know, I think I've done it before a long time ago and forgot. When you've got one of these that are set up to boot by Sardu or Yummy or something like that, then or the Fedora, there's a, an app in, it comes with Fedora to make a Fedora boot card, SD or uh, USB. It's hung up. I'm going to try one more time, but I'm pretty sure that's what happened. Put it in a different slot. I probably won't even see it now. <coughs> I'll hit up 11. We'll see. I've got three Windows 7 systems, and all three of them have got virus problems. Two of them I'm going to reformat, or one of them. I'm thinking that I might just get down to one Windows 7 system to have to jack around with fighting viruses and all that. I really don't need that many of them. The one I used to build this this uh, Sardu boot SD card with is the one I'm scanning right now. <coughs> so I can't just go in there and fix it. I'll have, uh, I've got a Windows XP that I could run Sardu on, but heck, half the time it's, you know, as old as it is, half the time every time I boot it up, if I scan it, it's already infected something. That time it didn't see it. I did the same thing as the last time. Well, except for I had it in there that time. So, take it out. Turn it on. <coughs> Go into the boot menu. It may actually uh, be mounting that thing. Recognizing it. I if it's mounting it, but it may be recognizing it when I plug it in there during the, with the boot menu up. <coughs> that is what I did last time. Let's see if that works two times in a row. Okay. Make sure that thing is in there good. Hit Control Alt Delete. And I want to go into the boot uh, boot menu again to look at it and see if it sees it. I should have moved this over, I guess. Where I'm showing. Okay, it sees it again. This time it's on the bottom. I thought it was on top last time. Anyway, there it is. That storage device. Same problem. <coughs> so, um, I had actually been thinking while I was off taking a break from this. I was thinking, uh, <coughs> let's see, I'm going to turn it off, thinking of other ways to go at it, <coughs> don't think, I don't know if I have Hirons on there, I have Hirons on some CDs, I'll put it in there and see, I don't like messing with CDs and DVDs anymore because they're slow to read and they make noise the whole time you're <coughs> working with them. At least this thing is down in the rack away from me. It will drive me crazy. The computer's up on my desk. I can't stand the noise. Got spoiled. <coughs> used to be the most wondrous thing, you know. Now, ever since we got USB uh, devices, you don't want to mess with those rattly, noisy DVDs and CDs. I don't. Okay, I'm looking for higher end. Harden's boot CD. I don't know if I have it on here or not. <coughs> Might be in one of these. Envira? Oh, that's the only one on there. Did I run a Vira on here? I bet I did. Nope. Sure don't. I'm going to leave it on a reboot. <coughs> I'm going to go up here and get mine. <coughs> I'm going to have to move my keyboard tray in order to get to that. I can see that. I'm going to stop the video.